guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm the Reaction Fairy, and today we're going to be reacting to a Christmas movie. I'm super excited. It is the month of December, and as you know, it is the month of Christmas. So this month, we're going to be watching a bunch of Christmas movies. I hope you guys are super excited and happy early Merry Christmas to anybody who celebrates it. But today, we're going to be actually reacting to a movie called Home Alone. I haven't seen it before, and I looked up a list of popular Christmas movies, and this one was on the list. So today, we're going to be watching Home Alone. I'm super excited to have a really cute kid on the front. So let's get into this movie. Let's go. I will see you guys all in the movie. Kevin, out of the room. Hang up the phone and make me, why don't you? Ooh, Kevin is being naughty this year. Don't be rude to your mom, dude. That's not cool. Yeah? Do they live here? No. <laughs> no. Why should they? All kids, no parents. Probably a fancy orphan. I ain't gonna lie, he can't get no help. He is like just trying to talk to the parents and nobody, everybody's like, uh, screw you, dude. But Merry Christmas, though. When I grow up and get married, I'm living alone. Did you hear me? I'm living alone. Okay, Kevin is a mess. Beautiful salt. That's where he keeps his victims. The salt turns to bodies. Oh no. This is so like an older sibling just scaring the hell out of their younger sibling. Where you going? You hear me or what? <laughs> going on a trip? Where you going, kid? <laughs> okay, guys, I love this guy. Oh my god, he's hilarious. Shit, I actually really like this character. See, I'm the Pepsi. Oh no. Oh no, he gonna piss all over him. <laughs> it's like he's happy about it. Like, why? You know you pee in the bed, dude. Don't drink. Damn, unless you have an that dude about the toilet, and then it's all bad. <laughs> Look what you did, you little jerk. Come on, guys. Oh, everybody's upset at him. I mean, come on, guys. He just wanted cheese pizza. Why did y'all eat all the cheese pizza? Damn it. <laughs> little Kevin is going through. No wonder he wants to live alone. But, I mean, look. This is his family. He got to learn to work with them. I spoke to your husband already. And don't worry about your home. It's in good hands. Now I'm worried about my home. Now I'm very worried about my home. So is he going to be a villain? I thought he was going to be like some funny dude who was like a good guy. I thought he was like, like he's a cop. So is he like a crooked cop? Oh my God. <laughs> You're pretty sad if you woke up tomorrow morning and you didn't have a family. No, yeah. I wouldn't. Then say it again. Um, Maybe it'll happen. I hope I never sh Oh my God, guys. Is it going to happen? Is it gonna actually happen to this poor kid? He's just mad. He's just saying this up because he's mad. He doesn't mean it, but he shouldn't say that during Christmas time, especially to your mom when she's probably working hella hard to make everything magical. <laughs> oh my God, this, I love this movie, guys. I love this movie. I don't know why I didn't watch movies that much when I was a kid, but I'm really like, damn, I missed out on a really cute movie. I would have been so, I would have so loved this movie as a kid. Heather, did you count heads? Eleven, including me. Five boys, six girls, four parents, two drivers, and a partridge in a pear tree. Ooh, they're gonna leave Kevin. They're gonna leave him! They're gone! So he is actually gonna wake up with no family. Did we miss the flight? No, you just made it. Yeah! Yay. Wow. Hey, go see some big folks. Take whatever's free. You can tell this movie is pretty old. I don't know exactly when it came out, but you can just tell by the hairstyles and stuff like that that it's a quite old movie, but I really like it. It makes me remember my childhood for some reason. It probably came out during that time, maybe. Mom? Oh. I made my family disappear. Yeah! He's happy? I thought he was going to feel really bad and start crying or something like that. He's like happy. He's like, fuck it, bye. But then again, getting to jump on your parents' bed would have been great as a kid. What else could we be forgetting? <laughs> oh, Kevin! Go. She remembered. His mom remembered. Crap. Now she's not going to enjoy her holiday, of course, but she's probably going to be, like, all fucked up because she left her son on accident. Stereos, VCRs, toys. Probably looking at some very fine jewelry. Wow. So they're going to rob them. Also, it's just crazy to think that VCRs was actually, uh, like, valuable back then. Oh my god! Ah! 
They go to rob a house. I mean, they don't know the little kid is there. They don't know he's there. But still, what are you robbing people for on Christmas? This is crazy that people do this. Wow, a pay phone! He's home alone. And I... Okay, okay, we'll send a policeman over to your house to check on your son. Why would she have an attitude? Like, ma'am, my, my son is home alone. Do your job. What the fuck is wrong with you? Just send a policeman. It's that simple. Oh, no. Shit. Wait, where's the spider? Where's the spider? Where is the freaking spider? Wasn't it on the shelf, right? Guys, I'm terribly scared of spiders. I would I would have never climbed this shelf. Oh, I couldn't live in this house. I couldn't do it. Uh, I mean, I guess if I was raised here and maybe I was raised around a spider, I'd be okay with it. But, but no, I don't think so. I don't think I'd ever be okay. You're right. They're gone. Wow. I knew they were. So Sir. No. No. What a day. This has been a nightmare for this kid. <laughs> I mean, honestly, though, he seems like he's having a lot of fun with it. I mean, <laughs> I would have been pissing my pants. The wet bandits. You're sick. You know that? You're really sick. You're yeah. Sick. Yes, you are. Yeah, no, that is sick, dude. You already robbing people, and then you're going to turn my water on and let it flow through my house. So you're going to water damage all the shit that you didn't steal. So everything I had left is done. You know, Kevin is a really smart kid. I'm not sure how old he is. I think he's like nine or something like that. It's the tree. I'll come back tomorrow. I'm going to be gone. <laughs> it worked. You better get out of here before somebody sees you. It freaking worked, guys. So they are leaving for sure. God, Kevin is a genius. He is a genius. If I watched this movie as a kid, I would have been like, I want to be Kevin so bad. I want to be that smart and that cool. I gave you to the count of ten to get your ugly... Yellow, no good off my property before I pump your guts full of lead. <laughs> One, two, ten. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> no wonder this movie is so popular. This is so funny. This is so cute. He's so scared. I would have been start running when he said yell out, but I'm out. Can you, from a mother to a mother, please. Oh. Oh, Ed. This makes me want to cry. She just want to get back to her son. She's such a good mom. She's such a good mom. Wow. Shout out to all the mothers out there. And just all the parents in general. Fathers too. Thank you guys for everything that you do. Seriously. You make the holidays so special. I'll never be a pain in the butt again. I promise. Aww. He's sleeping with a picture of his family in his parents' bed. Poor Kevin. I hope his mom hurries. I mean, she's trying to get back as fast as she can. This is very heartwarming, but also sad at the same time. In the paper this morning. So he's shopping like a full-on adult here. <laughs> he is shopping like he's just a grown man, and this is all normal. <laughs> this is so cute. Two. Yeah. Supposing the cops finger us for a job, and they start asking us questions about a murder in the area. Wouldn't it be nice to have a face to go with their questions? That's why, you know, the polka, polka, polka. Polka, polka, polka. No? Mm -hmm. it, Twin Lakes polka. <laughs> See, I would have been like, okay, let me just act like I know what he's talking about. But then again, that could lead to other problems. Maybe he might ask me a question. I'll be like, okay, I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. But I would have tried to act like I knew just to make him feel good because he seems like a really sweet guy. <laughs> See, you're good. A ride to Chicago? Sure, you know, it's Christmas time. <laughs> See, I knew he was a nice guy. I knew it. He had good vibes. I have presents this year. I just want my family back. No toys, nothing but Peter, Kate, Buzz, Megan, Linny, and Jeff. And my aunt and my cousins. Oh, How heartwarming! He's such a mature little boy. I love him a lot. Honestly, Kevin is great! You think about what I said, alright? Okay. Wow. Nice talking to you. Nice talking to you. <laughs> you know, I would have never thought that he would have been the person that we needed to talk to. But he was the first one we needed to talk to. We definitely judged him wrong. This is why you don't judge a book by its cover. It might be creepy. A little bit creepy. Well, actually, you know, he's not even creepy now that he's looking normal. But he was, like, going out of his way to look creepy back then. <laughs> oh, he is not going down without a fight. Oh, that looked like it hurt. 
hurts so bad. Ooh, I hope it wasn't. Oh, wait, it couldn't have been on. I don't think. If that would have been hot, that would have been even worse. <laughs> You're not going to get into his house, Kevin's house, without going through it. Fucked up his whole look. Merry Christmas. That's just oh he oh god. Oh my god, if you don't start crawling, I would have been crawling. Like fuck, I'm not standing up ever again. Ooh, that that looked like it hurt so much. Heads up! I've been seeing that all movie. I just love Kevin so much. I love this movie. So Dream Girls. I just 656 looking bullhorn. My name is Murphy. <laughs> so he's actually calling the police finally. And he's acting like he's somebody else. <laughs> he has everything uh, laid out for the Oh god, he tripped. <laughs> he has everything else laid out for them ready for them to be uh taken down quickly. I can't believe they're still coming. He created all this awesome stuff in his own house. What a genius. What a genius kid. Of course it's a movie, but still. Still cool. Go back downstairs to his fun house so we get all tore up. Here come the cops. He's not calling a From a tree house? <laughs> come on. <laughs> oh my god. Mom. Hey guys. <laughs> Check this out. Oh, oh, go back. <laughs> so, Kevin, you predicted everything they were doing? Or everything they were gonna do. He was able to figure out their every move before they made it. He outsmarted you this time. Get over oh. here. I hope they don't beat him up, but they probably are going to. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Look, he looks so cute now. Now that he's like looking normal, he looks like a cute, sweet old man now. But at first he was looking kind of kind of weird. I like him a lot. Thank you. You saved us right on time. He's leaving the water running. Now we know each and every house that you've hit. <laughs> Lord, y'all gonna go down. I don't know how many houses y'all hit, but oh shit. That is, a, that is actually really dumb. Now you caught. Like, now you seriously caught, and ain't no getting out of it now. Your troubles will be out <laughs> of Kevin, you are a fool. <laughs> Oh, this movie is so good and heartwarming, but also like not what I expected. You know, I love it. Oh, what a good mom, Kevin! You are such a lucky little boy. You are so lucky. I hope now he doesn't take his family for granted, and I hope they don't take him for granted either. He wasn't all the way wrong in the beginning. I don't place the blame all on him. His family, his siblings, everybody. Guys, I love this movie to death. Aww. He got his family back too. What a great message, guys. What a great one. But anyways, guys, I hope you guys did enjoy my reaction to Home Alone, guys. It was an incredible movie. Perfect Christmas movie to start the month off with. Um, it's just very impactful. And very wholesome family movie. Hope you guys did enjoy it. I hope you guys do enjoy your Christmas and your family. Please do stay safe and um, have a lot of fun. And also go along with the theme of the movie, guys. Don't take your family for granted. And don't take the small things for granted. And also be thankful for everybody around you. But anyways, guys, I will see you guys all next time. And I'll see you guys probably like next week or the week after that with another Christmas movie. Be safe. Bye. Merry Christmas. Thank you.